The men's player of the week is Khalil Dukes of Niagara University. Khalil Dukes averaged team highs in scoring with 28 points per game and in assists with 6.0 per game in two games. For the week, Dukes shot 50% from the field, 50.8% from the three-point line, and 85.7% from the free throw line. In Niagara's win over New Hampshire, Dukes notched his first career 30-point game with a game-high 31 points, including 22 in the second half. Dukes, who was fifth in the NCAA in three-pointers per game from beyond the three-point line. The eight three-pointers are tied for the second most in program history and are the most in the MAC, and are tied for the sixth most in the NCAA this season. Dukes followed his career-high 31 points performance with a team-high 25 points while dishing out a career-high 11 assists for his first career double-double against St. Francis. Dukes made a game-high nine free throws, which are also a season-high. The MAC Rookie of the Week is Rich Kelly of Quinnipiac University. Kelly scored the final eight Bobcat points, including the winning driving layup with 4.8 seconds left as Quinnipiac picked up an 89-87 road win over Columbia on Monday night. He finished the game with 22 points and 10 assists, becoming the first Quinnipiac player to have 20 points and 10 assists in the same game since Rob Monroe in 2004-2005. His game-ending run started with a three-pointer to trim Columbia's lead to 85-84, then the tying three with 127 left to make the score 87-87, setting up his winning layup. He was 6-for-10 from the three-point line for the game, the first Bobcats since Daniel Harris in 2015-16 to make six threes in a game.